UFC down in Dallas. And today we're gonna go ahead and count down the top five boosts of the show. So hey, we're gonna go ahead and look around and check out some really cool booths. So let's see what else is going on here at the show. So hey, after looking at the whole show, you know, it's really a tough thing to ever table in this booth. It's just incredible. We have to narrow down to five booths, so you know what? We're at the top five booths right now, and number five is Rusty Balls. They specialize in ball pythons, and it's really cool stuff. I'm Rusty, and these are my balls. This is a hypo ball python, one of my favorite morphs. Still a very basic one. This is another one of, uh, my uh, enjoyable ones, the clowns. I love the uh, variability of them and the color change as they uh, mature. It's a great little animal for playing with and another great one for uh, mixing and making some really cool ones. But. Okay, so there it is. That was the number five coolest group with Rusty Balls. Now we're on to number four. And I'm telling you, this is a cool boat. This is all about chameleons. This is amazing blue chameleons. We're going to be talking with Jim. He's going to show us some cool stuff and some feeding of some chameleons. You guys are going to love this. Hey, uh, my name is uh, Jim Mazaki. I'm the owner of uh, Amazing Blue Reptiles. And uh, we specialize in these uh, beautiful panther chameleons. Uh, we also do bales and other species as well, but our primary love is for the uh, panther community. If you love chameleons, sooner or later you're going to have a panther community. Uh, let me show you one of the meetings. It's one, one of their fascinating aspects. And, and that's how they eat. Yeah, as you can see, they're very friendly and uh, very docile, not aggressive at all makes a great pet. Okay, so hey, we're down to the number three booth. What we're gonna do here today is actually combine number three and two. I just can't decide which one's better. They've got a lot of similar animals. So we're gonna go ahead and interview both Bob Clark and Mike Wilbanks. So they're gonna be kind of number three and number two, but they're gonna be about the same. So I don't know, they're both two and a half, let's say. It's an al albino reticulated python, uh, purple face albino. Nice snake, tame, friendly. Now these are uh, titanium retics. This is another recessive trait. These, these are these guys have a nice uh, pattern and or, or lack of pattern. The, the color is very bronze. Just a very pleasing uh, pattern. I think they'll be good too. Sun globe boat constrictor. Uh, made by breeding an albino to a hypomelanistic salmon. It's a motley boa. It's a co-dominant gene. has that really cool side stripe. The homozygous of this is a almost purple boa with no pattern. Really, really cool. This is the Jampia dwarf reticulated python that we used to breed into the albino to get the size down. And the cool thing about it is it, besides just bringing the size down, all this green that is in the Jampia caused the color to really pop out in the albino. And I think that's one of the reasons that the dwarf albino is such a nice, nice morph. Okay, so hey, we've been going around, we've been counting down, and we're finally at the number one coolest table in the show. I can't express how much. I think there's so many tables in the show, I could probably have picked a hundred coolest tables, but you know what? We gotta narrow it down. So here we are at Sean and Celia's Exotic Fly Nature. They have some great stuff. We're number one! <laughs> this is a hypo Aztec boa. We were the first ones to produce these guys in 2007. It's a combination of a hypo and an Aztec. They're gonna really do a lot of stuff for both. And this pattern is really incredible. We also brought a hypo Brazilian rainbow boa here to the show. 
It's a really nice animal. These guys are lacking black. So they're just a really cool looking snake. This is an albino cinnamon pastel. See, she's got this really nice yellow blushing and stuff. Really spectacular looking animal. Well, Celia, we got the prettiest show at the table in the show. What do you think about that? That's good. We work real hard, right? Yeah, we work real hard. All right, well, I'd like to thank God, my mother, Celia, and all the people who lost. 